Heart Gold, Soul Silver, Randomizer, Nuzlocke, Versus! What up? Back. <laughs> Doing another Heart Gold, Soul Silvers, Versus! Episode 10? Yeah, yeah. Uh, no, 9. Uh, 11. This is a... 11? No, 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 no this is 10. This is 10. This is 10. Yeah. 9 goes up, Um, I guess... Episode 10. Like Friday, Friday. This will be a Monday episode. Oh, so, okay. So this is this is ten. This is the start of uh, next week. Um, where are you at, Dave? I'm in a Pokemon Center after just getting destroyed at that gym. We got to figure out what's going on here. So, all right, I'm in. Going. I'm in Team Rocket's hideout. I figured out there's another static encounter, so I'm gonna dip out of that and go check out that one just in case it's good, so I can train. Yeah, I gotta go do that too. Okay, ready? One, two, three. Let's get it on. Okay, actually, I gotta figure out what I was doing. That's not what I wanted. Okay, yeah, so I'm down just to my X Plowed, and I have a Poliwag as well. But, I mean, that's not really gonna be much help. Well, it might, it so might be. I, and I'm also using my new controller. This is so nice. Oh yeah, nice. Um, do you know what level that? Uh, it's mod level is? twenty, so it's pro. It's worthwhile for you to go. Okay. And then while you're there, you can check out uh, any of the TMs if you can buy them or not. Um, sell yeah, some. I'll, I'll go back and do that before I teach. Explode. Yeah. And make sure you sell all the items that you um, you don't use. Like, and also get rid of that choice band or choice scarf thing that screws you over every. Oh yeah, did I do that yet? Get rid of that. Yeah, I already removed. But that. he's not dead, so he'll go on the. Oh, okay, so. Oh yeah, I didn't want to go. Get wait, that. I got a. Oh wait. Cross die. Uh, oh, I guess I gotta go there now. Die. Yeah, I think she did. But I'm not a hundred percent. Uh, whatever. I just want. I got a Hitmonlee. When did I get a Hitmonlee? That thick fat. Thicky boy. Oh, I did teach him Thunder Punch. Okay. Oh, maybe you did that right at the end. Uh, yeah, last time. Fun. But, I mean, you, you... Like, Spout being a normal type, um, can learn a lot of different moves. So, he might have a pretty good move pull if the random T in, um... Thingamabob. The Pokemart can be good. Um, oh, and you can also... Um, you've been to the Pokemon Center in Ecruteague, right? So you've talked to Bill, like he ran up to you right away? Mm, yeah, you must have. Cause yeah, so you can get another random Pokemon there. I just got another Frost Glass as my random. Oh, really? Yeah, it's level 20 though. Where you just talk to him there? Yeah, you just talk to him right there, and he's like, "You want to help someone out?" And you just say yes. You get it. So I got another frost glass. Is yes. it in the back of the Pokemon Center? Oh, uh, when you go into Ecruteague City, Bill comes and runs at you right away. So you've probably already talked to him. Okay. And then when you go back to Goldenrod City, he has a house. Uh, let me double check so I can. Oh. But he he has. Oh, I gotta a, go back to Goldenrod City and get two free. Yeah, ones. yeah. But the one he gives you is level five. So where the Pokemon Center is, Goldenrod City. Um, there's like the game corner, the purple house. If you keep following that path, mm -hmm. um, and then the first house. Well, I'll wait until I get there. Yeah, the first house there has, um, has that. Got this. I have to grind up some of these. After I get Salamence, then I'm gonna change my other Pokemon. I gotta get How a... close are you? Um, I'm, him? I'm, I think they're just 38. Yeah, he's level 38. So pretty mm -hmm. close. I don't remember if I turned on Fast Revolution, so every Pokemon will reach its final stage at level 40 or not. Mm. I, I don't remember if I did that for us or not. Oh crap. 
But I have to teach uh, something cut. Oh yeah, I just have an HM slip. That's what I have. Like my Marip that died episode one or two. Um, is my HM slip, but knows all its. Oh, okay. Yeah, I'm gonna have to have another HM slip because Marip knows already. Get on! For XP. I think I think it's this same trainer every time these that ball toy. It's funny, my metapod is pretty much a metapod. Because it's like shell guns basically like the dragon for for these mm -hmm. little shelly boys. Okay, so I'm in Goldenrod. Actually, wait. So it was the north exit, right? The guy. Yeah. So where you're gonna be entering, it's there's like a girl that looks like a a Pokemart center girl, and then it's the dude that's right there behind the desk. You talk to him, say yes, and he gives you a Pokemon right away. And its name is Kenya. And it's a Slugma. Slugma's not bad. It's fire. You don't have a fire type. Yeah, that's true, and it is level 20. Um, so, I mean, it's right around where you're at, even though 20 is, like, a little bit behind. Ooh, it's also got Smog, Ember, Rock Throw, and Harden. Yeah, so, so it's got it's a, de not, a decent move yeah, it's pool. It's not terrible, but... What's its ability? Uh, oh, I didn't check. Scrappy. Ooh, actually, that will help me out. I mean, yeah. although I guess it's all. I don't know when it evolves, though. Yeah, it is a special attacker anyway, but Scrappy just enables moves to hit Ghost type. Oh, that, yeah, that's not bad. But I've got all special moves anyway, so. Yeah. Um. And then yeah, if you keep going down to where the Pokemon Center is, you'll see like the purple game corner thing, and um. Oh. Uh, okay. Yeah. Yep, to the yeah, left of that. Yeah. So you keep going down, and it's the first house on your. What's hand in my waving on your left? So it's not the very bottom. It's the first. It's the house right above that. Oh, I don't There's have three people on it. Yeah. So talk to Bill, the brown-haired dude, and he gives you a yeah. Pokemon. It's level five, so it's not right where we're at. But if it's a good Pokemon. You might be okay. Oh, he's about to use a Torterra. I'm guessing it's not what it says it is. No, no, because it's normally it's an Eevee. Uh, I can't tell what that is. That graphic, look, it looks like an Aeron, but I can't tell. Go well, open it up and take a look. You take a look at his stats. And... Oh, I gotta name him. Um... I'm losing my new Kenya to take out this dude's Torterra since ice is uh, quad super effective to uh, grass and ground. Oh! Yeah, that was yeah, a, a cargo. He's Metapod because he's got Sky Upper Cat. So, what has he got? He's also got Scrappy. Which actually that helps him out a bit, but yeah, he's only level five. He's got tackle and harden. But it's it's Aaron though. Yeah. Um, you can always you're almost about to get XP share. So I mean, he's a decent mon if you end up wanting to train him to, yeah. to have. You're, you're you're close to where you get XP. Oh, I why I got another Moonstone as a random item. Um, is there anything else I need there in Goldenrod? No. Um, if you go to the Pokemart to check out the TMs to see if there's anything else oh, right. good for um, Exploud, yeah. So you, what you want to do is open up on your second monitor um, everything that Exploud can know as a TM, and you can match the numbers up and then read the description and figure out which move it is. 
because it's it's not going to be what it normally says but that's an easy way to know if it's a tm that he can learn and then read the description if it's going to be a good one uh four i believe oh i did Oh, I wonder if Hitman Lee was my ring. Good job. So let's see what else he learns here. He learns Stomp at 29. Which is Crunch. Kind of man. Crunch, crunch is good, but I mean, 40 is going to be for beam at 71, so that's not really going to happen. But I mean, one, you could get lucky and one of those TMs could be Hyper Beam, even though it's random. Oh, uh, okay. So you just got to read. You can see what the TMs it knows, match the number with it's there, and if it if it's the same number, then read the description in your game, and you can try and you can kind of figure out what sh what move it is. I mean, if you have trouble, you just read me the description of something that you know I should be able to know. Uh, it's not the fourth floor. Oh, then maybe it's the fifth. I I know it's up there. Okay, yeah, here we go. So TM70. So even though it says TM70, it's not actually TM70. No, that's so if it can but learn the description TM. Description is correct. The, no, the description's different. Oh, sorry. The description is correct for the move it is, but it's like TM70's flash. I just I know that because I just checked it out. Okay, and it says the user takes a deep breath and focuses to raise the critical hit ratio, which obviously is not flash. No. But TM70 is what you got from the old dude in the first town from Sprout Tower, because that's where you get Flash. Uh, okay. So you already have that TM anyway, if you haven't used it, which it doesn't sound like it's very good anyways. It sounds like a towel yeah. or something. Okay, so the next one here, the foe is stomped with a big foot, so that's obviously stomp, which he's going to learn anyway at 29, so that's not worth it. I mean, uh, it could be worthwhile ooh. replacing. If stomp does more. I got another one here. The user attacks with a sinister beam of light. It may also confuse. Um. I beam, I think. Um, yeah, I don't think he can learn that. Yeah. So whatever he learns, like, don't look for psi beam. Look for the number. So whatever, if he can learn TM thirteen, and there's TM thirteen in the store, then read the description. Okay, so T. Okay, so TM eighty three in the store. What? Oh, I just ran into Salamence in the rock. Oh, I gotta Ooh. see if. I gotta see if that. Um, I don't remember if that hit move was when I caught it. Here, so I have to read. Um, you can you can talk to me, Dave. I just gotta go look at the. Okay. Okay, so what you're saying is that if it says TM eighty three. And he can learn TM83. Yeah. It doesn't matter what it, even if it's a move that he normally can't yeah. learn. Yeah. So, so in the guide, it'll tell you all the TMs he can learn. So, say. Yeah, which he can learn 83. Which okay. So then you go into game. your game, and the description in your game tells you what it is. So, like, if TM83 is normally, like, say it's Sucker Punch, right? That's what it normally is. In your game, it's not going to be Sucker Punch because it's random. But the description right. of it will tell you what it is. Oh, so uh, you can you can read me the description, and I should be able to know it off okay, the top so of my head. Okay, so this one, which you think is Psy Beam, that's not worth learning on him, I don't think, is it? Um, I mean, a psychic move, I, like, see, the thing is, is stab doesn't really matter in this. If it's a super effective move, it's good. Stab only matters for competitive. Yeah, and he does have high <sighs> physical and special attack, so. Yeah, so it doesn't matter. Recording is start up. Right. Okay, so that's an option. The next one is that's a sleep one. And um, then you still have some good okay, mods so that, that use with items. Good. 
user strikes at the foe with a hard bone two to five turns in a row. That's probably not any good. Um, oh, that's Boomerang. Uh, hail Storm, or just Hail, one of the two. Well, that looks like it's Reflect, or it's whatever the other one is. Something else, anyway, uh, whatever the try, Light Screen is. Explode, Thunder Punch. Um, Oh, what is this one? The user, or if the user can use this attack after the foe attacks, its power is doubled. Um, I honestly, I don't know that move. I don't think it's very good. It's either, I think it's either a normal or a dark move. I think it's okay. maybe, it might be pursuit. Okay. Uh, what about the move that works differently for ghost type than all other types? That's curse. Yeah, so but... curse will it'll it'll say like, yeah. So it'll raise your special or something. But it'll take my HP down to half. That's a wild relic. Yeah, I don't. The only thing I could see here would be that AD three, which is the sinister beam of light that can also confuse. What's what's he know? What's what's explode? No. What's his move for? Right now he's got bite, um, headbutt. Um, I forget the other two. Okay. So he's got bite, headbutt, thunder punch, and super sonic. I can't. So I, I can't, can't play can't. super sonic. Yeah, if you're not using it a lot, I might as well, I would get Psychic just for it's another stab move for you. Then you can hurt. It would be super effective against Poison. Like right now, my Metapod, he has Zen Headbutt, Psychic, Bite, Dark, Sky Uppercut, Fighting, and Dragon Breath as a Dragon. So he's got a pretty good move pool going. Mm -hmm. Like Stab, Stab really only matters in competitive. This isn't competitive. You just want to beat the other dude's mons. So if you're over leveled or even and you have super effective moves, it's still going to be better than like a stab headbutt. If because like so say he has tackle. Tackle does 40 oh, damage. Signal beam. It's not it's not psi beam, it's signal beam. Oh, is it? Well, yeah. I mean if he can learn signal beam still, that's a bug. It's still worth it. Um I don't remember what bug super effective again. Flying Wait. rock and fire. I don't understand. Oh, I... sorry, no, that's what it's weak against. It's strong against grass, psychic, and dark. Which I do need something against psychic types. Okay. Well, don't you have bite? You have bite. Uh, yeah, yeah, that's true. Uh, I do need something effective against grass, though. Well, then pick it up. I, I mean, you already have it, though, don't you? What? Signal beam. Like, no. didn't you get it from some? No. Oh. I had silver wind, is what you were thinking. Oh, okay. No, someone used signal beam and you were talking about it, right? Yeah, I would get signal beam and pick it up because I think it's like an 80 or might be 70 attack move. So if you only have like a 40 base damage move, it's going to be better. Yeah. Well, I'll replace supersonic for now. Yeah. So I mean, it's it's definitely worthwhile. Oh, this dude has a trap, which I ain't scared of. I'll get rid of it. Just knock it off. Screen. Who's, uh, I forget, what, do you remember what Pokemon took you out? You were at the gym leader, though, right? Uh, I know he has a Salamence, and, but I think I killed that, and there's something else that, uh... Oh, yeah, me. um, while you're there, you can get better potions, so I would concentrate on getting better potions. Yeah, I guess I might as well buy a couple on here. Is that right here? No, it's probably on the second floor, right? I can get some hyper potions. Well, I wouldn't waste money on hyper if you only have like 60. I would still use just soup. 
right? Like, if you have 60 HP, you're going to be healing when you have 10 HP. There's no point having a hyper potion that's twice as much money. Yeah, that's true. Okay, so I grab some of those. Especially, especially if you're tight on money. If you don't got items to... Oh, man, my, uh... My thing just messed up. I'm going to have to save and reload. Hard stuff. Man, these random items are... What did we do again? Did we close down the whole... Yeah, so save it, and then just reload the ROM. Okay. Gonna find out... Halfway into 40. I did find out if my bit of Salomon. 60 water. Uh, I won't. Out. So, when do we get the EXP share? Um, after you. So, your shiny encounter, the Gyarados, after you kill it or catch it, um, you get the red scale. And if you go back to Mr. Pokemon, um,. He will take it from you and give you XP share. Oh, okay. So basically, I mean, you have to do. I guess you really don't have to do two more gyms, because as soon as you beat him, you'll be able to use Surf. So you could go and get um, the shiny Mon. It's level thirty. Which will help you for the next two gyms. Because the next two gyms are like... He's got two... I think this first one's the strongest is 31. And the second one's like the strongest is... The fifth gym has two Pokemon. And the sixth gym I think has four. I wonder when I caught this lease, uh, this Hitmo Lee. I don't remember. Completely, uh. Completely baffles me. I mean, I really hope that I put quick levels on this because I want to sound. <laughs> Dusk stone. Why am I getting all these stones? Oh, there's also electrode. Get a static mod in here. I can only capture one. So there's six electrodes or three electrodes you have to fight, but. You can only capture one of them. Mm -hmm. The thing. So, hopefully, whichever one I pick, it's a good mod. Or if I don't like it, I'll kill it. And move. Oh, man. Agron! Oh, no, that's okay. I got Sky Uppercut. I got Sky Uppercut. Okay. And also, it's only a level 17, so <laughs> I'm not even worried. Yeah, honestly, you could probably go and do the rocket hideout, like, right right after you're done the fourth gym, so you can surf outside of battle. And, uh, since these guys are only level 17, that'll be decent XP to train with for you before the other two gems. Yeah, but do you think I can do this gym now, which is these two mons? Yeah, he had he had one he has four Pokemon, he only had one left, right? Yeah. So as long as you have potions and just take your time and make sure you use your super effective moves, you should be okay. Alright. Oh 
Yes, it is level 40. Yes, I'm getting a Salamence. Metapod is evolving. Woo! All right. If you if you want, Dave, just start out with Exploud, and let me know who you're against, and then I'll, I'll give you suggestions on what moves to. I won't I won't screw you. Over. Oh yeah, I got a little Salamence following me now. Oh yeah. Now I got a stage three month. About the time. Oh my rival just booty hole okay, him. So he's got Carnivine first, which is he just is he grass poison or um I I don't know if it's pure grass or grass poison, but if it's just grass, you have signal beam now, so that's super effective. You should be able to two hit it. Mm, well if he's grass poison then it's not gonna be, but let's see. We'll just I try it out. Be... I think it's pure grass. To be completely honest. I think it's just pure yeah. grass. Yeah, it is because it's super effective. Okay, so oh he has a sliver of life left. Well that's that's no that's fine. You can two hit it. Yeah. Oh he hyper potion. Yeah, he's gonna hyper potion, so you're gonna get free hits off on it. Yeah, oh I killed him that time. Okay, so next I don't like has... Salomon's sprite in this game because it's just his head and neck. Like, oh, in, really? when you're fighting him, like, the reverse is just his head and neck. That's it. So next he's got a run, which is Steel Rock or rock. Steel Ground? Steel Rock. And what's your move pool again? Uh, I don't really have anything that's super effective. Signal Beam, Headbutt, Thunder Punch, and Bite. Um, but you can... Uh, I don't know if... Signal Beam's not very effective against Steel or not, because it would be okay to use Signal Beam because it's a special move, and he's only got defense. Like, he has high defense. I don't think he has high special defense. So Signal Beam would be okay to use. Might be okay. Well, yeah. Sorry. Otherwise, if it's not very effective, probably bite. Yeah, no, it didn't really do anything. But did it say it's not... Defense. Yeah, it said it's not very effective. Um. Okay, then I would try bite and just spam bite. Bite's also not very effective. Okay, then just do six. Thunder Punch. No, um, Thunder Punch. It might be that neutral. Be yeah, yeah, it might be normal because I don't. I think it's normal against Rock, but I'm not 100 percent sure against Steel. It is normal, but it didn't really do much damage. Oh, and it just used Roar. Okay, let's... so brought out my level five, so that's not gonna work. Well, you can either. I mean, if that's not a good Mon. You can use that turn to use a potion and heal Exploud and let that yeah, Mon get I sacked. Keep this, I want to keep this Aeron for when I get the... Uh, oh, okay. The XP share? Yeah. So then you can switch to... Uh, I just switched them back in. Yeah. Yeah, so whichever move that you use did the most chip damage, just keep using that. Yeah, I think Signal Bleed did... The most, I think. Yeah, because I think Signal Beam's a base 70 damage attack. So it should be... Rush Oh my god, he keeps... Okay, he killed himself. He did. Okay, so I think this is the Salamence. You just take down. Yeah, so now it's the Salamence. So I need to potion up here for the first round. Yeah, and then... So, you can use Thunder... I, think I just used Headbutt. You can use oh, can you, you, punch. yeah you can use thunder punch because it'll be neutral and it has a chance to paralyze. Yes. Oh, mm, it really didn't do that much. Um, well, Signal Beam's not going to be very effective. I think Quad not very effective because it's Dragon Flying. 
Um, he keeps hitting me and flinching me. I can't even do anything. Well, he potion up and then just wait because he's using headbutt, right? So you have headbutt yeah. and thunder punch. Yeah. So you can try headbutt and see if it does more damage. If it doesn't, I would just spam thunder punch for the chance of a crit or um, paralysis. If you can get a paralyze off. Is that his third Pokemon or? Yeah. Okay, so he has one no, more. After that. I got two potions left. I'm just spamming potions because he keeps taking me down the under half. What with his headbutt? Yeah. I have to risk a headbutt here. And he did. He's he outspeeds me. He just killed me with a crit. I guess you can sock your other two mon. No, I think I'm screwed here. I would have to level up quite a bit. Uh, he just killed him. Well, what level is his? 23. And what level is Expoud? 26. I mean, there is trainers you can go train against. Um. Where at, like, if you kept going left from the town, there's a grass patch and there's trainers you can go. Well, I just fainted and we're at 30 minutes, so. <laughs> yeah, I just realized, okay, I'm in the middle of a battle, but uh, Lance, is who's supposed to normally have Dragonite, his Pokemon is Wobbuffet. <laughs> uh, yeah, I just, I just started this battle, so I'll finish it. Finish this. Please remove the I I didn't think Salamence would do that much damage to you. I thought you got your um your explode would be bulkier. I didn't think it would two hit your explode. I thought it would three. I thought yeah, it well, would three hit it. It was flinching me too, so I couldn't even do anything. Yeah. So when the moot you'd heal. Oh no, because he would. Yeah, and he, he outspeeds you too, right? Yeah, the only thing you would have to train, you'd have to get like level 30, which wouldn't be too difficult because you're only 26. That's only four levels. Hmm. I think this might be it. You're already so far ahead of me. You're like two gyms ahead of me right now, right? Uh, yeah. Yeah, like, I'm just getting to, like, the tough part of the game. Like, I'm, I'm okay, just... You can't remove mail, but I can't deposit a Pokemon with mail in it. What do I do? I have no idea. Open up the mail. Try opening it. Yeah, I did. I read it. I guess I can just take it. Okay, there we go. All right. So I just beat the Team Rockets. So it's, I'm just in a cutscene. I'll let this cutscene. <sighs> All right. All saved up. That's episode 10. Like, comment, subscribe. See what happens in the next one.